Hey everybody and welcome back to Fratini's channel. Um, firstly an apology for not um, doing many videos over this last week. Um, I have been quite busy as you know in previous videos I've mentioned that I've been doing like decorating and stuff. So um, I do apologise that that has taken up a bit of my time. Um, we have got another diamond painting to unbox today. Um, this came... Um, well, actually, I'll go through the actual information right now. Um, I ordered this. Well, I ordered this from a seller called Colour Whisper Store. Um, I've not purchased a diamond painting from this seller before. Um, it's a 50 by 65 um, full square drill diamond painting. And it's entitled Sunset Glow Lighthouse Scenery. Um, I did show a picture of this when I did my previous unboxing. So you have an idea of what it looked like. Um, but I ordered this on the 19th of August. Um, I ordered this on the 19th of August. Um, it was shipped. It was shipped on the 22nd of August. And it arrived with me on the 29th of August. So pretty quick um, turnaround from like ordering to dispatching and getting to me in the UK. Um, first of all, I just want to mention the packaging. Um, it does look... This mic gets highly annoying sometimes. Um, it does look like it's... It's survived relatively well actually. It feels a little bit squished on this end corner here. It feels a little bit squished there, but apart from that, it looks it looks like it's pretty pretty well packaged, and it's covered entirely in like like a bin liner um, with with tape over the top. And I have no idea how I'm going to get into this because I don't think I've ever had one wrapped <laughs> this well before. Um, right, bear with me a second while we see if we can get into it. This painting underneath is um, was the next painting I was going to work on, but um, I've decided I'm going to start working on Christmas gifts instead after I've finished with the cat and flower. Purely because um, I just can't comprehend how quickly this year is uh, is going. Um, I can't believe that we're almost in September, and it's just frightening how quick time's going. So. Before I know it, I'm going to be out of time for Christmas. They were originally meant to be birthday gifts, but obviously I ran out of time for that. Um, that was birthdays in July, so I ran out of time for that. So they're now going to have to be Christmas gifts. So as soon as I finish my cat and flower, because as you know, I like to finish one diamond painting before I start another. Um, and then we'll, we'll make a start on my first Christmas gift. Okay, Ooh, I'm going to have to take it off the camera for a second. Right, there we go. That was hard work getting into that. <laughs> right, so it looks like we've got one of these lids that you just pull off. Oh, I don't know though. Yeah, it looks like they've attached part of a lid from another box onto this one. Um, there's, there's the packaging itself. It looks relatively in good nick. They always seem to like crease in the middle. It's weird how that happens. So let me see if I can get into this side. So I've never ordered from this seller before, so I'm a little bit in the dark as to what the quality of it's going to be like. Um, so far, it looks like it's done okay. So it's in one of these slightly more oblong boxes. Um, there's the diamond painting there. I don't know if you can just about see in there. The, dr the, um, the tool kit. I don't know where the drills are. Okay, this looks like it's going to be in real good condition actually. It's it's covered in um it's rolled in a foam core. 
which is good. And then we've got our toolkit. Ooh, what's this? We've got some baggies. And there's all our drills. Wow. There's just a few drills there. <laughs> I don't know how many colours there are in this painting. It looks like there's going to be quite a few. And we also get an inventory sheet, which is cool. Right. So, <clears throat> I'm hoping you guys can hear me okay, because I keep moving away from my mic. I keep forgetting I've got like a desktop mic now, and it doesn't follow me around when I'm wearing my headset. Um... So then, we've got toolkit. I hope the light's okay as well, by the way. I haven't got any lighting on because it is quite early in the morning. So I've still got quite a lot of um, early morning light. Um, so we've got green tray with a cutout. No funnel, but we've got a cutout. We've got a basic pink drill pen with a three-tick drill placer. And some metal tweezers. And a long strip of wax. So we've got all the tools. We also, in inside the box, came a little baggie full of baggies. Which I probably won't use because they're very flimsy. They don't send... The quality of these isn't that great. So I don't tend to use them. But I keep them just in case of emergencies. Um... I smooth the drills over there for a second. Let's have a look at the canvas. Um, symbols look okay. Right, so I don't know if you can actually see that. I don't know if that's going to pick up. Let me see if I can get this to autofocus. I don't know why this doesn't autofocus. Bear with me a second. Right, camera control. It is on autofocus, so why isn't it focusing? Never mind. Anyway, so there is a picture of the canvas. What it's supposed to look like when it's done. I don't know why my camera's not focusing. I'm so sorry. My camera is just... Oh, there we go. Thanks. Wow, my camera today, it's been... You know, this webcam, I upgraded from my previous webcam to this one because it was supposed to be better. And I've had nothing but issues with it from the day I bought it. So it's a C922 if anyone is interested. And at the moment, I would not recommend it. So there is... I can't get it to focus. Okay, so it's trying to focus, but it's having a hard time. I wonder if it's something to do with the lighting. So there's the um, the thumbnail. Let me put a light on. Let me see if that helps. Okay, that might help a little bit. All right, let's try it again. Not really, it hasn't made any difference whatsoever. Okay, anyway, so I don't know if you guys can actually see the drill for the um, the symbols because of how poor my my camera is at the moment. But um, the symbols look nice and clear. I'm so annoyed. I'm really annoyed with my camera. So, there's the symbols. We've got some 310. I'm trying to move slowly so it doesn't cause my camera to have some kind of uh, issue. Okay, so it is trying to keep in focus. It's just not doing a very good job. Okay, so the symbols look okay. I've not seen all of these symbols before on diamond paintings. Like that one there, for example. I've not seen that one before. The others I think I've probably seen from time to time. Um, so yeah, the um, the symbols look okay. Let's have a look at the canvas. Okay, that was quite lightly put on. Just a small strip of um, tape. 
one in the middle and two on the corners or on the edges I should say okay right so just as a reminder I can't remember what size I said it was um, Right, it's a 50 by 65. Now, I know that I said I was going to start ordering smaller diamond paintings, but I figured, oh, this has still got another piece of tape on it. I figured that because this was quite a detailed image, I felt that having a, a bigger diamond painting would be better for this one because of the detail on it. Um, I might have got away with having a little one a little bit smaller, but I didn't really want to take that chance, so... I thought I would go for a big size. It wasn't the biggest size they did. I think the biggest size they did of this was... Um, see, I ordered this as well before the sale started, but I don't think this diamond painting is in the sale anyway. Um, biggest size they do is 100 by 100 by 135 so it is you can have it quite big so considering I've had it 45 by 60 it is quite small in comparison to to what size you can have canvas itself looks like it's going to be in good good nick let's get rid of this Phone call. I'm going to keep that because I've got an idea for that. We just had a new fridge, one of these American style freezers, and where we've got it situated, that when we open the door, um, it is, there's a chance that it, someone's going to swing the door open so far and it's going to whack the the wall and end up denting the fridge. So I've ordered. Uh, so I thought I would use the this foam core to put on the corner of the wall. See, there's more than one use for them. <laughs> Okay, so this is quite big. That's why there was a mass of drills. I'm going to need to move my coffee because I'm going to spill it all over my desk. Okay, this is actually too big to fit on my easel. So let me have a quick look at the drill field, see what it's like. Make sure it's sticky and whatnot. sticky and it's all in one it's all in one sheet as well it's not in separate sheets oh shit oops sorry I swore okay the glue's come up on that side Okay, I've torn the cover sheet just slightly, so I might have to get some tape on that. I think it might get worse if I don't put some tape on. I'm usually really careful at pulling these back as well, but it's only a small tear, so it'll be okay. Okay, right, I can't actually see... You know, I'm wondering if I perhaps... Oh, we can see it now. They can see the lighthouse. This actually might be okay. This might be a good size. I think I chose... I think I chose right with the size. Okay, I'm not going to peel it any further back on that side. So you can see the lighthouse, which is here. You can see the little cottage, um, and that's like the sunset that's behind it. I don't know if you can see now because of the glare. Um, and then we've got all the the hill that it resides on with all the grass. So there's going to be a lot of green in this by the looks of it. Greens and pinks mainly. Greens, pinks and whites. Um, drill field looks really clear. I can see the symbols. It's nice and sticky. So if I just lift it up slightly, so maybe you can have a quick glance at the drill field itself.
Okay, my camera is just about focusing. It's not quite sure about it, but it's trying to focus. Okay, so the drill field's nice and clear. It looks like it's going to be a good size, actually. There's a few little creases in the in the um, in the glue, but I can get rid of those pretty easy with um, my craft knife or exacto knife, whatever you wish to call it. I think essentially they're the same thing because I call them craft knives, whereas I think in the states I think they're called exacto knife or in Australia, New Zealand, places like that. We Brits tend to call them craft knives. So there, this is a 65 by 50, so it's quite, quite a big painting. Well, maybe if I roll it up this side. I just want to check this side and then we'll have a quick look at the drills. I don't know why I do that sometimes. Sometimes I, I spend like time calling them diamonds and then all of a sudden I'll switch to calling them drills. I don't know why I do that. They don't have a very generic name for me. Depends on how they cooperate when I'm uh, when I'm actually diamond painting. <laughs> right, let's have a look at this side before it curls back up again. Okay. Well, I'm going to try not to tear it this time. Well, there's a lot of confetti, especially in the bottom sections, where you've got the flowers and the grass. Right, I just want to see the lighthouse from the other side. You can just about see it peeking through there. There we go. So, there is a lot of confetti in this area here, look. There's a lot of... Um, a lot of pinks, a lot of browns, a lot of green. Um, so there's a lot of there's going to be a lot of confetti in that one. There's a few little creases in the glue where the glue is raised, but I can I can sort that out. Um, the canvas looks actually really good. I'm impressed with the canvas. Symbols are nice and clear as well. Drill fields nice and clear. So I'm happy with the canvas. I just want to hope that the drills are in the same. All right, let me just get rid of the painting real quick so we can have a look at the drills. <clears throat> See, I don't have my dining table anymore to, to do unboxings with. We got rid of the dining table. We're having a new one. So I'm having to go back to doing my unboxings at my desk on top of my easel which isn't which isn't really that great right let me just get a pen so we can do a quick inventory if we have time I have no idea how long I've been recording for I didn't pay any attention at least 15 minutes Sorry about all the crinkling, guys. Okay, right, you, you'll be able to see a better image of the uh, of the painting now. So there is an image of what the painting should look like when it's complete. So as you can see, there's a lot of green, there's a lot of pink, like greens, browns, tans, that sort of colour. 
and it looks like it's had a quality check already <clears throat> so we'll, we'll do another one though it looks like it's been quality checked twice because we've got tick marks and then in other sections they've gone back and they've done another tick so they must have had parts missing or bags missing at, at some point right there's no busted bags of drills from what I can see so what I will do <clears throat> oh god frog in my throat this morning <laughs> I'm not used to doing like video so early in the morning so <clears throat> still a bit croaky so we have got a lot of um, I'm assuming this is 310 This, I really dislike this because where on that bag, I, I mean I can just about see it, but where on that bag can you see what the DMC code is of it? It's obvious it's 310 because I don't think we have any 939. We don't actually, no, we don't have any 939. So I know it's 310, I can just about see it if I tilt the bag. But it annoys me when they do this and you can't... Anyway, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 3 tens. Oh, wow. Um, they, they do these differently and this is what confuses me because I always forget. So it's, there's 5 bags in one of these, isn't there? So it's 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35 bags. <clears throat> so 35 bags of 310 so check right 819 20 see I don't like it when they do it like this because it confuses me 3328 one bag see that that makes sense Right, one five zero one bag. Three eight three seven one bag. Okay, someone has put a tick. I haven't actually put that tick there. Someone else has put that tick there. 3328. Oh, it was me. I'm losing my mind, guys. I'm losing my mind. I'm going to leave that 819 to one side for a second. Um, 552. Three bags, yep. One six five, some yellows. Where is it? Where would the yellow go? I'm guessing it would be on like this, the yellow part of the grass. One six five, two bags, yep. Do you guys like me doing the um, the inventory at the same time I do the unboxing, or would you just prefer not to see the inventory at all? I know that this is the most time consuming part of the video so I'm, I'm I'm interested to know if people like me doing the inventory or if you just rather me skip it all together five five three four bags right three eight six five you should have 16 bags so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. So we've got sixteen of those. Um, three, eight, six, zero, <coughs> eight bags. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. A nice colour pink. 
I like I like paintings when they're nice and pink like this. One, two, three, four, five, six. So three, six, oh nine. Oh, hold on a minute. Three, six, oh, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we should only have four. So I'm going to put plus two. So they give me two extra bags of that one. Right, what have we got here? Um, three, eight, seven, one. Is it three, eight? Three, three, seven, one. I rest my case. Three, three, seven, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And that's what they did at the bottom there. Look, they gave me the number at the bottom of an empty bag. Three, three, seven, one, twelve bags. Yep. Right, four, three, six, one bag. Five, five, four, one bag. Five, five, four, we should have six bags. So I'm going to leave that to one side. Um, three, eight, three, six, six bags. One, two, three, four, five, six. So three, eight, three, six, six bags. Three, eight, three, five. 3835, we should only have three bags, and we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, plus three. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, three, two, three, seven, two, seven, should have nine bags. Okay. Oh, here we go. Three, seven, two, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10 of 3, 7, 2, 7. So we've got that plus 1. So they're giving us a lot of extras, which concerns me. Have they given me extras because they've forgotten the others? Um, 3, 5, 5. Two bags. Yep. <clears throat> um, 800. What is that in there? Looks like a different colour, like a different DMC colour, but it's like completely missed the mark altogether and it's not even gone through the cutting process. 800, one bag. Yep. This is like um like a I don't know if you can really see that on the video really but it looks like a sagey greeny kind of colour. One two three four five six of nine three six. Right, we should have fifteen bags of those of nine three six. So I'll put them to one. Oh, hold on, what's these? One two three four five six seven eight nine ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. We have 9, 3, 6. Okay, so we've got plus 1 of that as well. We're getting a lot of plus 1s and 2s. What is this one? Let's get this one out of the way. Um, that's 8, 2, 3, 1 bag. Right, we've got 9, 3, 8. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve of nine, three, eight. Yep. Nine, four, eight, five. One, two, three, four, five of nine, four, five. Yep. All right, nine, six, three. We should have eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven of nine, six, three. How do you guys prefer out of interest? How how do you guys prefer receiving your drills? Do you prefer them like already in the little ziploc bags, or do you prefer to to do them like in this method in the 
in the little plastic bags that you have to cut open. Okay, um, this is um, a very odd looking green. Five, eight, one, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, five, eight, one. Seven, three, two, eight bags. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine of seven, three, two. So you've got plus one of that as well. Whoever did this cannot count. <laughs> um, seven, nine, two, one, two, three, four. Yep. That's a nice colour. I like that. 605, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 11 of 602. Um, what was it? 605. And we've got a plus one on that as well. All right, what have we got here? 819. Okay, we can marry that one up with this one. Um, 20 bags, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 20 of 819, check, You're nearly there guys, 3, 7, 4, 6, 3 bags, yep, looking good so far we've got a lot of extras three eight one nine two bags yep wow look at that that is such a vibrant color i like that i wonder if that's for the actual lighthouse itself the stripes 900 one bag yeah that's a really nice color i don't think i've had a painting with that color yet and a lime green that's nice as well 907 two bags yep three zero two three four bags yep and we've got here two tens we should have six bags one two three four five six of two ten two oh nine should have nine bags one two three four five six seven eight nine of two oh nine two one one six bags one two three four five six of two eleven um eight zero three Well, we don't have any 803s on here. Eight zero three. Okay, we'll leave that to one side for now. Um, Eight hundred. One bag. Oh, we've got an extra 800 then because I've already marked off 800. So I'm going to put plus one there. Guys, we're getting loads of extra beads on this. See, beads, diamonds, drills. Three, zero, four. Two bags. Yep. Three, three, six. Should have six. One, two, three, four, five. Six of three, three, six. Um, three, four, oh. Four bags, one, two, three, four of three, four, zero. Three, 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 one bag, yep. Oops. Three, seven, one. Should have four, one, two, three, four. Four one three one two three four five six seven eight four one three. Yep. Right, 
Right, one, five, three. We should have four bags. Yep. Two, zero, eight. We should have two bags. Yep. Um, five, five, zero. Should have six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now, I have a diamond painting with this colour, five, five, zero. And it looks, the one I'm doing now actually, and it looks so much different in the container to it do, how it does in the bag. Obviously, it's from a different seller, so they're, you know, the, the colours could be different. But And then we've got 554, which, ma see, these are different, that's a different shade look. Look at that. Look how different they are in shade, yet they're the same colour. Hopefully that's not going to make a massive difference. Can you see that? How more of a like a sandy colour that one is, but this one on the right is more of a like a lilac. There's quite a difference there. So five five four, we should have six bags one two three four five six so we do actually have six bags but we've got an extra one and i'm just going to put wrong shade there so we've got a plus one so we've got the same dmc code as a, an extra bag but thankfully all the six bags that i need are all there together so we've got here 803 now am i missing any I've got all my drills and we've got plus 3803, which we didn't actually need. So we've got, so out, So how many colours are there? There's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45. So there's 45 colours in this diamond painting. Wow. And out of the 45, we've actually got... Um, we've actually got one extra bag of 554, which was the wrong shade. Um, wrong shade of 554 so I'm going to keep that out to the side I'm going to keep these I'm not going to put them in I'm going to keep these as spares um, then we've so we've got one extra bag of 554 which was a slightly wrong shade we've got um, plus one bag of 605 we've got plus one bag of 732 we've got plus one bag of 800 we've got plus one bag of 936 We've got plus two bags of 3609. We've got plus one bag of 3727. And we've got plus three bags of 3835. And we've got an extra three bags of 803, which we don't even need. So <laughs> there's a lot of extras here that they've given us, which is, which is perfect in my opinion. I would rather have more than not enough. Because at least then it takes into account any um, any trash diamonds, you know. So it gives you that bit of peace of mind knowing that you're going to have the right amount of diamonds. Um, so I am happy that they've sent at least one or two, three on some occasions, extra bags of some colours. And I'm a little bit confused as to why they've sent those 803s. And... Um, and I'm going to keep that shade, that other shade of 554 to one side. And I'll keep these as spare. So, my overall rating for this then, um, just to go back through who I purchased the painting from. Um, right, so the seller was the Colour Whisper Store. So, I've never ordered from these before. So, I'm definitely recommending these because of how they've... You know, over sent, you know, overcompensated with their diamonds. The canvas is in fantastic condition. We've got an inventory sheet. So, in my opinion, that the canvas itself is really good. There's no creases. There's a few bubbles in the canvas, but I can um, in the in the glue, I should say. 
but you know that's something that we can get rid of really easy so I ordered this on the 19th of August um, it was dispatched I think on the 22nd and it arrived with me on the 29th so so nine days ten days ten days that's really good um, so yeah and it was sent by AliExpress standard shipping which I normally upgrade to I normally sometimes pay if I've got a coupon I will sometimes spend what I get from that coupon and use that for paying for extra shipping because I would rather it be like that just take 10 to 14 days than it taking two months so um, so yeah I would definitely recommend this store so if you haven't bought from from this seller before then I, I would uh, I would recommend them I'd give them a shot um, we have got one other diamond painting on the way um, I've wanted this one for a long time and this was the one that I had it on my wish list for a while um, but I was waiting and I waited for it to um, to go down in price because I, at the time the only seller I could see this one on was ever moment and it was a little bit expensive but on the sale um, I've got another one coming now from I can't remember the seller Damn. Um, I can't remember the seller that this is coming from but I will have that information when it actually arrives with me um, but anyway just to, to show you because I've wanted this for so long and would you believe it I don't even have a picture of it Right, I'll have to zoom in on this picture and show you. It's that one there, the cupcakes, which I'm pretty sure that all of you at some point have seen before. Um, but at the time, the only seller that I thought was reputable <laughs> at the time was Ever Moment that I'd saw on AliExpress. Um, and I've got this on the on the sale, so oh, I can't see who the who the seller is why can't I find the seller of this one hmm. it doesn't tell me the seller now I must have gone about this and just bought it without actually um, paying any attention to where I was buying it from drill shiny I think it is it looks like it's drill shiny I've never bought a painting from these before I think yeah so anyway I've got that one on its way I've no idea when it's going to um, arrive with me I only ordered it yesterday it still hasn't dispatched yet um, but I'm guessing because they're having a sale on they're inundated with orders but yeah I don't know I think I did that out of um in haste I just saw it saw it in the sale bought it so hopefully that's going to arrive all okay um but yeah going back to this one then yeah I would definitely recommend this color whisper store um I definitely give it a thumbs up so I'm going to end this video here um Again, I apologise for not doing many videos this week as I've been quite busy with decorating and gardening and doing variation of different things. Um, but I will do my best to get another video out sometime next week um, and do a, a draw with me. Um, we st I still desperately, desperately want to finish my cat and flower off. We are getting there. We're about 85% done now, so... We are getting there so hopefully by the end of the weekend I might be seeing the light at the end of the tunnel and then I can start working on my Christmas gifts so thank you for watching everybody as always don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video um, I know it's been a long one um, 
and um, don't forget to comment and subscribe if you did enjoy this video and let me know um, if you do prefer not to see the inventory in an unboxing or if you would like it all together I mean I know lot, not everybody likes to have the inventory in an unboxing video because it takes up the bulk of the time so I do understand that it is time, quite time consuming um, so just give me your thoughts and feedback on that whether whether or not you want me to carry on doing inventory when I get diamond paintings if not I will just do them off camera it's not a problem but I would rather do a video that I know you guys are going to enjoy and not get bored of watching like 10 minutes in you know so so let me know what your thoughts are so I'm going to sign off here then have a great day everybody happy diamond painting and I will see you all in the next video take care guys and I'll see you soon bye bye